area is really hard. Have your particles all on. He should probably explain how to do that for the uninitiated. Just because I'm nice, that is some random shiz. Nah, that's that's just random junk to get you to look at it while creepers spawn up ons. That's all that's about. Ah, seriously? Now I gotta fiddle fart with the everything and... Oh, hi. Well, your spawner's gone. What you gonna do now, Mr. Creeper? Nothing. Okay. A horse saddle? Why would you even... What would that even... Oh, there's a stick. A special stick. Give me the special stick. Silk touch. Ooh. And a bed. Okay, I gotta put this stuff back, cause, well, if I have a chest, I can just stash it quick. Right, let's take a look at what we got. Silk touch. Glass Harvester, Diamond Hoe, Golden Pick, Stained Glass, Oak Planks, Redstone, Carrot on a Stick, Saddle, Dead Bush, Nemo Fish, Some Pistons, Dispensers, Buttons, Oak Sapling, Iron Bars, A Clock, Some Golden Apples, TNT, A Bed, Activator, you know. I'm gonna make use of that actually. No, no, I'm not. Spawn skeleton. Block of quartz. A bucket. Okay, that that was totally just a distraction ruse. That was the only point of that is you give you a chest full of junk. Mostly junk and have you distracted looking at it while well, a whole bunch of creepers spawn up on you okay interesting of course I don't want company. That's a lot of literature. This part of the map is just weird. Like, legit weird. I halfway expect this room to blow up, so I'm gonna put all the books out there. Pretty tricksy if you trap the blocks above there, so if you break them. Alright, that's all we got. It's books. All the books. Yeah, that's all we got. Well, that means we can make all the bookshelves. Man, seeing unstacked bread makes me think of ye old Minecraft. Okay. Well. Oh. We'll move the bread too. If I had an axe, I'd just pop a bunch of chests. 
Okay. Now, you know, I gotta check all these. I can't just not check them. Miss out on a stack of coal. Two stacks of coal. You know, call me crazy, but I suspect there's a block update detector. No? No? Alright. I was thinking maybe the ones you put coal in, if you put something in there to smelt, it would like set off a trap or something. That was just my thought on it. But he didn't do that. So we're all good. Minecart. Well, that's... This looks like an intersection. Doesn't it? Hmm. This reminds me of a present. This whole area is really weird. Like, I don't know, it's got a weird feel. A weird feel to it. I thought I heard like blazes or something, but. There are four areas in each corner of the room. One of the four areas has the clay, but the other three has good loot. Each corner focuses on a certain mob. Also, many of the mobs are invisible, so good luck. This isn't an intersection, in case you were wondering. It does look like one, though. Alright. What do we got? Invisible skeletons. Now I'm just gonna go out on a limb and say that the clay is in invisible creepers section. If this is invisible creepers, it's totally over here. Supercharged. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna guess that one. Maybe. Batter invisible skeletons. Um, armored zombie sounds the least dangerous. So I'm ahead there. Oh! They're armored and invisible. It's pretty funny looking, actually. Oh. Well, I have it already, so never mind. If any of these guys are wearing like iron armor and have a chance of dropping it, we should totally uh, save the spawner if we can. Oh, hi. I do not have 
the torches required for this. Nah, not nearly the torches uh. required. I bet that door locked behind me, didn't it? Didn't it? Oh. Gave us buttons. How nice. Okay. I got a... There's like glowstone in this entire room. Alright. I'll take some glowstone. Because I don't feel like going back. See, this would also be a good time for the silk touch uh, stick. Lots of glowstone. Okay. We'll see how far we can get with this. Probably not very, but, you know. It is what it is. Giving me a bit of a time. And one for you. This all looks like leather zombies. spawns here are going to give us a bit of trouble. And this guy's got boots as well, it looks like. They're slowly getting better and better armor on the zombies. Oh, hi! Yeah, that was uh, not what I was going for there, but whatever. And we got the armored zombies coming into the pit with us. Great. They don't seem to be dropping any armor. I wonder if I'm just unlucky or if that's intentional. Was there really only one spawner in here? That is a suspicious dark area up there. Like place. Iron sword is cutting through them pretty well, even with the armor. Yeah, I'm gonna see if I can get to that dark area over there. If we see as if we hear a zombie, though, we gotta turn around right away. They're invisible, so we won't see them coming. Bing. Okay. We found a chest plate chest. We found a pants chest, so I assume there's two more chests to be had. Based on the pattern. I really hate skeletons. 
they're way too good at aiming. Like, their aim is god level. Look at this. Stop shooting so fast. There's a guy behind me somehow. Alright, I gotta run away. Run to live to fight another day. Please don't follow me, skeleton. Dang it. You followed me. Two skeletons. Dang it. Uphill skeletons are the worst. There's a creeper nearby. And what am I getting hit by? A zombie from behind. Okay. Well, that was pretty intense. Just like camping. There you went, creeper. Wondered where he went. Is that a skeleton spawner? No, I'm just unlucky enough to have a skeleton. Camping a not skeleton spawner. Okay. Random shit again. Okay. A nether star? What the heck, man? Spawn spider. A nether star. Okay. Sure. Is that really all that's in this wing? A nether star? Well, I say that like a nether star is nothing. A nether star. I keep thinking some of those are like glowstone lamps, and they're not. Speaking of glowstone, I am out again. Are you kidding me? This is not skeleton area. You know, I bet invisible skeletons is a lot more annoying than it sounds. Now that I'm dealing with skeletons... Yep, yep, yep. Don't blow up. Mm. The worst part about them blowing up is they make more dark areas. <laughs> and then scary noises happen, and I don't like scary noises. They're scary. Should have probably brought the nether star with me. Oh well. Gold. I just realized the value of that gold. I'm not sure whether there's a gold block in the Victory Monument or not, but if there is, then that would bring us a significant portion of the way to accomplishing it. Uh, food now, too. Oh, we got zombie food. That was just armor. Okay. Seriously? I have half a mind to light that up, but I'm not gonna, because I want to save my glowstone for the actually important parts of the map. So if skeletons are spawning, I think I might make an exception. Dang it. So annoying. Did he just blow up the glowstone I just placed? That guy. Okay. Now that we've wasted all of our glowstone. Wait, there's still guys spawning from somewhere? I thought I should have disabled all the spawners. Oh, maybe it came from below? That doesn't really make any sense, does it? Boy, there's not a lot of, uh... 
walking space here. Oh, hey. Yeah, they're definitely coming from above. Okay. But where? Where? What is up here? A spider. Uh huh. The mystery is solved. Oh, there's a whole room here that I haven't done. Yep, let's just jump down on it as quickly as we can, right? Sounds like a plan, right? Best kind of plan. Let's just charge in foolhardy like. Let the creeper blow us up. Why not? They can take the hits, I tell you. All right. Room done. All right. Yeah, looks pretty done. Water breathing. Book and quilt. Anything written in it? No. Stone monster egg. You know what he should have done was rename that stone. <laughs> More bedrock. You know, now I'm wondering if there's a bedrock on the... Uh... Man, I don't even feel like picking this junk up. <laughs> so I'm not going to bother. He spawned with some glowstone around his thing. So maybe I should get rid of the spawners. It would seem that just having a block of glowstone on top is not enough. Which is maybe where all these guys were coming from. Any other spawners close at hand? Nope. All right. Must be down below. All right, we're low on torches, but we don't need torches if we break spawners. Where we're going, we don't need torches. Figuratively. And literally. Did I see a skeleton down there? I'm having a good time until he showed up. There's a lot of spawners down there. Huh? I don't think they can get up here right now, though. Yeah. 
That's just the best block in the world to stand on, isn't it? Oh, they're on our pick. Well, that's a problem. But not for Silit Bang. Alright, I don't have a strategy. With a broken thing. Well, the only thing down here is that chest, so if I can just get to where I can access that, I don't need to go down there get all that experience. I'm taking that, and that, and that. It's not even a throwing potion, that's like a drinking one. And that, and those. Well, I feel like we explored the zombie area. And we found nothing! Good day! Yep. Using glowstone as blocks now. <sighs> I feel like we explored it good, though. And these sorts of... Whoa, that's a lot of dudes. In these sort of cave-like areas, though, I always feel like I miss stuff, you know? Because it's... Like, there's so many holes that there could just be an opening in. Maybe there is, and maybe there isn't. I have to check every room from every possible angle. Well, we didn't get the nether star out of there, but we did get some good stuff. Lost our pick. Alright, well. Oh, I should mark it. Bonk, bonk. Bonk, bonk. Okay, well, the hour is late, and I must do some sleeping or something. <laughs> See you next time.